Inside your Eve or Ava, you're going to find a few different types of chords. You'll find your light chords. So you'll see these running out from underneath your light. And I've got two quick connects here that run to the chords and timers. So I'm going to start by just letting those dangle. You're also going to find your pump timer, which is this black box here. This is preset, nothing you need to do with it, and your power cord. So as well, I'm going to disconnect this right away, put these to the side, and then we're going to take out our reservoir. So it just slides down and out, and the pump comes out as well. And then the next step for us is going to be putting this aside and running our cords through. So I'm going to take my light cords, run them through the back hole of your Eve or your Ava so they can go to the cords. Pull those through. Then your pump cord where you disconnected it, that goes through the back as well. Now that we've got our reservoir filled up, we're gonna put it into our unit. So to get it in, drop the pump back in through the top, and then simply slide your reservoir in, pushing any cords to the side, and just make sure that that drain hose at the back is running into your reservoir there. So once that's in, you can push the pump all the way in and arrange the cords how you'd like. There you go, the reservoir is ready and set up to run. Now we're gonna give our pump a test run with that water in there, just make sure everything's working right. So the timer box and power cord that you unplugged at the start is gonna be plugged back in at the back of the unit with the cord we ran through the back. This timer will run automatically, there's nothing you need to do to set it. The settings are right there on the back. So you can see this one runs for 20 seconds every 30 minutes. So 20 seconds on, 30 minutes off and it will always run as soon as you plug it in. So I've got it plugged back into the other end of the pump and we'll plug it into the power bar here. And you can hear and see that it's running correctly. You can see the water running back down here. No leaks anywhere. This is exactly what we're looking for and what we'd expect. The water running down the back of the top in the irrigation system.